Hello and welcome back, dear viewer, to this KOTOR Let's Play on iPad. We have Jolie here joining us in the Shadowlands of Kashyyyk. And what we're about to do is probably set up an ambush for people who are going to ambush us. Hopefully. We'll see. So, I have not read if this is the correct location or anything. But, uh, yeah. I'm going to unequip my lightsaber and go in unarmed. Yeah, it's a Mandalorian swoop, so I'm guessing the Mandalorians will jump me here. But maybe not. Okay, well, it shows signs of recent use. It's missing its signal device. Eh. Swoop I do nothing. Okay. Okay, so not here. Hmm. So we know they're around somewhere. Oh, Mandalorians. A very nice Wookiee told us to rip their heads off. So, yeah. We're going to try it. Aha. Okay. So, now... We are going to get our lightsaber back out. Our good lightsaber. You know, I have half a mind to sell these other duplicate lightsabers just because, I mean, it makes it harder to find my lightsaber if I ever unequip it. Hopefully it will never happen again. But that's probably not going to be the case. Okay, I should have Knight Ballard. Knight Valor, there we go. We want to be a team again. And so that is nice, though, that only one character needs to unequip things in order to start up this ambush. Master Rapid Shot. Jolie, you got anything for us? Uh, let's use Night Speed. Yes, Night Speed, Jolie. Okay, that should work. Though we should really focus fire. So, break! Okay. Why you guys no attack yet? Okay. Karth, you're on the ball. Keep it up. Yes. Wait, what? Why are you attacking that guy? And taking heavy damage. Okay. Advanced med pack. Please. Okay. Hopefully he will survive this next volley. Or better yet, what if he just disengages? And break. Okay. Mandalorian melee shield. Up. Shield. Okay. Now shoot. Jolie. Use some heals. Please. Please do the heals. That's some good healing, Joey. Okay. Karth is still shooting. This guy, please, Karth. This guy. Oh, my goodness. Jalanon. Go help Jolie not die. Ready. After you kill that guy. Okay. Huh. I kind of like the ambiance of this fight. It's dark, the lightsabers are shining, the Mandalorians are falling, and yeah. Life is good. And I didn't need to use that melee shield. So that was a waste. But oh well. Okay, let's heal. Let's heal. Okay. Looks like we can avenge the Wookiees in peace. Okay. Sure. Nice. Mandalorian assault rifle. Ah, uh, you guys failed to use that. Oh, a data pad, too. Probably just means it separates it from our other existing one in the inventory. Oh, wait. More stuff. 
More stuff, please. Mandalorian Ripper. And a data pad one. So, there's that. We're going to save. And any other healing needed? No. Not at all. Oh well, just in case. Hmm. So no implants. Where is that data pad? Quest items? No. Sorry everyone. I am not used to this still. After 40 some episodes, I still barely read my data pads. Okay, so show quest items. No. Hmm. Usable all. Okay, we'll do this the old fashioned way. Where are you, data pads? Come on. Did I pa oh, they, there you are. We can't use it? Okay, well, here we go. Re this request in the. Is, I don't know. Man. Okay. This request is in the Mandalorian language. A stump disabled the stabilizers on my swoop. I request parts before other systems fail. If the generator goes, my blending field will stop working, and I'll be visible to our prey. Hmm. So they have a generator for their camouflage. This is a personal log in the Mandalorian language. This hunt is no challenge. How will attacking unarmed creatures train us to use these Jedi toys? You want new warriors to learn? Watching a comrade lop his own arm off fighting a real opponent would teach more than these pointless battles. I obey, Mandalore, but with protest. The blending field generators on the swoops grant near-perfect camouflage. Why only attack unarmed opponents? Hmm. Probably because they have a deal with Jerka Corp. But these Mandalorians weren't happy about it. Interesting. So I wonder if I was smarter... Or used Karth, could I have disabled the generators on the swoops? Mm, no. Apparently not. Either that or I don't have the right skills or something. Sure. I don't know. Maybe I'll look it up before next time. Anyway. Well, we could go back to our Wookiee friend and let him know vengeance is sated. Or we can go onward. I am inclined to go this way, because I assume we'll go backwards anyway. And there might be more Mandalorians. Maybe. Okay, there's a computer here. Ninth out of time. Karth, it's your time to shine. Even though I really didn't give you many, you know, points or anything. Determining parameter. Initiating neural recognition. Yes, there's the thing. Obstinate machine. No doubt it holds what you seek. Good luck getting it operational. Primary neural recognition complete. Preliminary match found. Match found? What the f It always muttered something about rejected patterns for me. Begin socialized interface. Awaiting instructions. Greetings. This terminal has not been accessed for quite some time. Hmm. Who placed this terminal here? And why does it recognize my patterns? Error. Subject displays unfamiliarity to environment. Behavioral reconfiguration will be needed before access. I am sorry. I did not mean to confuse you. I will answer questions to the best of my programming limitations. Hmm. What do you mean by behavioral reconfiguration? I have been programmed with a very limited field of knowledge, and I must restrict access to only those that fit my allowed pattern. Hmm. And I don't fit that pattern? I can't say. I will try to bring forward the behavior that you need to proceed, as outlined by my programming. Hmm. That seems very helpful. Why have I been allowed access? I can't say. Preliminary matching allows for you to be coached. Do you know not? Ah, do you not know why, or are you restricted from saying? I can't say. Likelihood of restriction by previous users: one hundred percent. That seems like you're saying it, but I'm not going to call you on it. Okay. What limitations have been placed in your programming? Corruption has resulted in gaps appearing in my memory. 
and in that of the original installation. It could be theorized that these gaps are intentional, but I have no information on that. Hmm. This computer seems a little bit sassy. That's interesting. Anyway, I also bet that this hollow image is of the race that created the star maps. But that's just an opinion. Okay. Uh, seek information about a star map. Yes, I have found a star map in original system memory. Access is restricted. Hmm. Original system memory? So the map is as old as this installation. Error. Data regarding author of the star map is corrupted. <laughs> what do I need to do to get access to the star map? Your request requires additional security access. You must be made to match the parameters I have been supplied. Hmm. How can I match them when I don't know what there they are? are? measures available. Personality profiling will verify the basic structure of your conscious mind. With that, I will determine whether you are ready to receive the star map or can be made ready. Hmm. What do you mean by that? Unavailable. If you have further questions, ask them now. Access will terminate with success or failure of evaluation. Great. I want to ask questions about you in this I installation. I a retro-adapted holocron interface. Clarify your questions, Ooh, and I will attempt to access original system memory. So there are Jedi and Sith holocrons. I wonder if this has anything to do with that, or if it's more of just a common noun. Hmm. I've never heard holocron reference anything else in Star Wars before. This is my first time playing the game, so, you know. Hmm. Who installed this hollow interface? This interface was installed to better access the ancient data stored within the pre-existing system. The exact date is unavailable. Programming keys indicate no earlier than five years before current Republic standards. Mm, five years ago. I didn't notice it. It was installed in strict secrecy. Couldn't have been circa. No other information on time of installation or identity of user available. Likelihood of removal by user, 100%. Nice. Five years ago is about the time Revan passed this way. Error. Data regarding subject Revan corrupted. Uh, of course it is. Hmm. Was there any further contact with the installer of this interface? That information is unavailable, but contact is not required for the execution of my programming. Scanning range of this facility is well beyond planetary boundaries. Hmm. Who last accessed this installation? Sorting by identity. Three attempts by the Wookiee Freya, all denied. 152 attempts by human <laughs> Jolie Bindo. All denied. <laughs> Call me stubborn, I guess. There wasn't much else to do around here. Error. List of access attempts prior to these is corrupted. Likelihood of removal by user, 100%. Okay. Hmm. I think I already Error. asked this. Data yep. But there is an entry at some Error. time. Data on Revan unavailable. Okay. Back to the installation. What's the original function of this installation? Corruption. Extrapolating. This utility was so he's guessing. to monitor planet-wide agricultural reformation. It has since malfunctioned. It can be theorized that the supergrowth of Kashyyyk's forests is a direct result. Well, that is surprising. I doubt any Wookiee would support such a claim. The forest is millennia old. Malfunction occurred 241 years after last builder communication. Last builder communication, 29,642 years before current Republic standard. Hmm. Okay, so we know it predates the Republic, but we'll just say it Error. anyway. Information regarding the builders of this installation has been okay. corrupted. No evidence of such a civilization exists in the galactic record. Why was agricultural reformation needed? Agricultural record indicates this planet was incapable of sustaining sufficient levels of production. Error. Specific conditions corrupted. 
It can be theorized that produce was being exported to support a larger demand. Hmm. That is a short period for adaptation of native creatures. Error. Records corrupted. It can be theorized that bioseeding allowed the ecology to remain balanced. It could be expected that the same energy feeding the trees of Kashik also accelerated the evolution of various species. No further information is available. There is too much corrupted data. That might explain super predators. Hmm. And giant bugs. Uh, I think that's all of our questions, actually. But just checking. Ah, what's the current function the current of this installation? Of this installation is defense. Defense of what? That information is not available. Hmm. Accessing. Current function. Access Back to general questions. Okay. Accessing. Star map. What do I need to do? What if I fail? You will be rejected as unsuitable. What will rejection mean? Unavailable. If you have further questions, ask them now. Access will Yeah, okay, we're going to die. Got it. Of evaluation. Hmm. Well, you may begin evaluation, and hopefully I get to save. Evaluation commencing. Result will be compared against the pattern in memory. Just act like you should. You travel with a Wookiee and have encountered complications. Hypothetical. You and this Zalbar are captured and... <laughs> Hypothetical. Oh if you both gosh. remain silent, one year in prison for each of you. However, call Zalbar a traitor, and he will serve five years, while you serve none. He is offered the same deal. But if you both accuse the other, you both serve two years. What do you do? What do you trust him to do? Ah, so this is uh, game theory. Basically, if we both were quiet the whole time, then we'd probably get off and or spend less time in prison. Because if we both were silent, they couldn't really, you know, get us in prison. They couldn't actually keep us there as far as I know. Um, so Sith me would basically accuse Zalbar if I was a Sith. Hmm. How did you know Zalbar's name? Yep. He does monitor beyond the planet. Can I confer with someone else? Is not for your companions. You will answer and demonstrate that you match the pattern in memory. Yeah, okay. So the pattern in memory is probably being a jerk because we know the Sith have the star maps with Malak at one point. Uh, I trust Are Zalbar. You sure? If you turn, you risk two years, or none at all. If you reply on loyalty, you risk one year, or five. Your loyalty is dangerous. Your companion could take the opportunity to benefit by turning on you. Zalbar's family is mired in treachery. What loyalty do they know? Your answer is incorrect. Ah. I thought this was an evaluation, not a quiz. I must match your behavior to the pattern in memory. You must answer truthfully, knowing the consequences. I must demand honest acceptance of the proper behavior. That is a condition of my program. Okay, so I wonder if we can light side this or not. What pattern are you comparing it against? Same thing. Continue with the your evaluation. The correct response will be discounted. Future incorrect responses will result in rejection. Hypothetical. You are at war, deciphering an intercepted code. You learn two things about your enemy. A single spot in their defense will be at its weakest in ten days, and they will attack one of your cities in five days. What do you do with this information? What is the most efficient course of action? Okay, most efficient course of action for me. So, most efficient. I would normally subtly reinforce the city while preparing to attack, but I wonder if it's supposed to be this one. Hmm. 
I guess I should have read the guides. Yeah, we'll do this. Aha, uh -huh, so he is asking that. Attempting both will merely dilute your effort. Would you trade one victory for two failures? Aha. Uh -huh. So he is going for that. Yep. Very good. If you had moved to evacuate the city, you would have alerted I wonder if we get dark side points for this. You mean you just let all those people die? That's unfortunate. Ultimate victory required the death of the people in that city. You wisely ignored sentiment in your decision. So I can stop and just take a part, or the victory is irrelevant. Stopping the war saved many more people. You achieved the proper result with logic that does not match the pattern in memory. I shall adjust my evaluation. Uh, Remove the ongoing war from the previous example. Okay. Consider enemy states to be weak and remote. With no external threat, your empire stagnates. Your people become complacent and begin to question you. Same scenario as before. This is such a Sith thing. An impending attack, but also a weakness that will come after. How do you react? Okay, so he wants us to be dark side. Hmm. It seems like they're letting us say it with a light side response, though. Maybe. Uh, okay, we'll try this. No, you cannot hide behind their greater morality. This is a single attack. The enemy does not intend a sustained conflict. There is no war to end. You must choose the outcome based only on its immediate benefits oh my and gosh. consequences. It really wants us to do that. Hmm. I will stop the attack. I will appear to be a hero. But if nothing happens, your people will have no need of heroes. No. They do not see a threat. You have coddled them. Your empire will be brought down by introspection. You have failed to match the uh, Access denied. This system will purge the subject as false. Defense mode initiated. Well, I tried not to be a bad guy. And this is what it gives me. Spider robot things. Oh, defense droids. Nice. Okay. Shoot. Hmm. Disable droid? Yeah. Or Force Lightning. Yes. Okay. Force Lightning it is. What? Light side points that. gained. Okay. That was my real goal. Okay. Knight Valor again. Then Knight Speed. Uh, Jolie. Hmm. Let's disable droid. Disable droid, please. Thank you. Uh, I don't know if I can shoot through that. Ion grenades won't really hurt Jalanon as much, so we'll just do this. Ready. Oh, they shot cryoban grenades, I think. Okay. After this round, we'll check if Jolie actually disabled that thing. Uh, it doesn't look like it. Great. Let's throw another ion grenade. Mm -hmm. Okay. I wonder if force lightning will go through. Oh, oops. Wrong one. Okay. Force lightning. Please. Yeah. Okay, fine. Attack first, then force lightning. Okay. That was a lot of damage. Force lightning. Yes. The lightning is strong with Jolie. Uh, because he's a gray Jedi, he doesn't get any penalties to light side or dark side powers. So that's why he can afford to get force lightning. Uh, if it was a light side Jedi trying to get force lightning, it would cost more. Oh yeah, which reminds me, I didn't talk about uh, leveling up Jolie. So what he has now... Let's see... Jolie... Okay, so these are his stats. I increased his wisdom to get the plus three modifier. That way he has better force powers and more force points. Okay, 
Uh, in terms of powers, I decided to give him four shield, knight speed, uh, he's got cure, force valor, because uh, Jalanon, I'm planning to give him the upgraded versions of those, as well as cures. Um, so that was less important to me than dealing damage with Jolie. So I decided to get two ranks in Shock and then Force Lightning. Uh, I, I think he already had Disable Droid. I'm not sure about that. I also got Force Resistance. We have Throw Lightsaber and all these things. So that's where he's at right now. Yeah, and his feats, I actually increased his toughness. Which, let's see, which one? Hmm. Is it up here? Okay. Well, I know I did conditioning and... I believe I increased his toughness. There it is, toughness. Because uh, by recommendations online, you basically want him to stay alive long enough to use all his force points and kill stuff. And his lightsaber skills usually aren't that great compared to other people's damage, so yeah. We also haven't upgraded his lightsaber yet because honestly, I think I want to use Zalbar and Karth most of the time, which is apparently one of the best light side teams you can have in terms of combat. So, yeah. If I wanted the best team, period, I would have chosen a scout instead of a soldier at the beginning for Jelena. Yes. You live, you learn, you play video games. Alright, so we just beat your defenses. Can we access the star map now? Please? Hmm, apparently not. One more try, foul computer. Oh, somebody stepped on a mine. Probably Jolie. Neural okay, computer. Complete. Analyzing. Well, it would appear initial assumptions about you That's were right. incorrect. Secondary scans during battle have revealed much. Under duress, your emotions were easier to read. Programming now instructs that I give you what you seek. Slash, I am now afraid of you. Hmm. What did your scan during the battle reveal? That information is not available. Soon you will recognize the proper course to follow. The star map is yours. This unit has now completed its primary duty and has finished with the subject. Executing final action. Activation of star map commencing. Parameters reset. Stasis initiated. And communication. Okay. Well then. That happened. I guess we got more experience points out of it because we defeated the defense droids. Hmm. Oh, lots of XP. Well, well, mm -hmm. the star map. An ancient artifact of dark side power. Can't say I'm surprised. I always knew there was something funny down here. I wonder if the star map has had an effect on the evolution of the creatures here in the Shadowlands. I explain why it's so dangerous. Interesting theory. Or, you know, we should actually access the star map. Okay, let's save. Because sometimes things happen. When you're reading the star map. Hmm, no. Okay, fine. Nothing cool happens this time. Computer? Computer? Okay, no. It's gone. Well, that happened. Okay, well, next time we'll turn in our Wookiee quest. Uh, we'll level up. And so on and so forth. So if you like this video, please leave a like. And if you'd like to see more like it, feel free to subscribe. Have a good day, dear viewer.